Um, great crowd. Uh, Kids Day. I uh, thought our marketing, uh, Chris and Rick and his team of uh, guys and girls that help out with that department, our marketing program has been really neat. Uh, I know my kids enjoy this day. They talk about it for about a week straight. Um, so to see all the different costumes and all the different things we had to offer here today, I thought the crowd was great. I thought it was one of our better atmospheres. Um, Really happy for our players. Um, I thought they executed a game plan really well. Um, and anytime you can make 13 threes, you're going to be hard to beat. Um, I thought Michael Akuche was tremendous. Um, you know, career night in points, career night in threes. Um, you know, he and I have talked the last couple of days of, you know, he was shooting 18% in league play. He's too good a player for that. Um, you know, sometimes as a shooter, you overthink it. Uh, coach can do one of two things. He can either uh, add to that thinking or he can just try to help the player through his struggles and just by shooting the ball. Uh, I've always been a guy that wants to give our players confidence on offense, hold them more accountable on D. Um, we ran some really good stuff and his teammates, you know, got him the ball and then Will started making them as well. So anytime you have two bigs that can step out, shoot the three, and then also take advantage of mismatches, it opens up driving lanes uh, for, for a lot of different players. So really happy, um, you know, for our guys. You know, our ball pressure, Joel, uh, was really, really good. We've talked about it here for, you know, the last three or four days. You know, Ethan does a real good job with our defense. It's vastly improved from last year to this year. We still um, need to get it better um, in certain areas, but it, it's been drastically improved from last year to this year. Um, so you got to guard the ball. You got to be in the gaps. We talked about building a wall, um, you know, on the ball, right? Like being really good on the ball, being really good in the gaps, um, finishing possessions. Um, you know, they're in the first half, there's three or four possessions. Their players, uh, you know, we didn't let them get the rebound. Uh, a couple over the back calls. Um, that's tremendous defense, you know, and I have a lot of respect for, for Milwaukee and Green Bay's programs. Um, they've had a lot of success in this, in this league for a long, long time. A lot of great coaches, great players. So to be able to be a part of something uh, and sweep those guys, those two programs in a regular season for the first time ever in school history, uh, I'm glad I'm a part of it. You know, I give our guys a lot of credit. They went on the road uh, there and took care of business and then did it here at home. That's hard to do because Pat's a good coach. Will's a good coach. Um, we're going to try to build off of this momentum. Um, and we're down to nine games, Joel. I mean, every game gets a little bit bigger, but we're back to 12 and 10, 6 and 6. You know, you're you're right there knocking on the door. Um, and you got to take it day by day and understand each game gets more important. Well, if you could tell me we're up 20 and a half, I'll take that all day. Um, you know, I thought our guys were relentless. He made a great adjustment in the second half. He made some good adjustments. Um, and uh, their kids never stopped playing. Uh, I give their kids a lot of credit. Um, you know, that can go one of two ways. And, uh, you know, we had some lulls there where we couldn't find the basket. Um, and they just kept coming and coming. And um, you could almost hear it in, in the gym uh, it, when they cut it to 12 with about 340 to go. Um, and I think the crowd helped us put it over the top um, with the momentum. And, um, you know, we just have to learn how to do that. We practice it, um, but there's nothing like playing in a game with, with a lead. And without Shamar, you know, I think that's some of it. Um, you know, Luke's back. Um, this kid is something else. You know, he's been wanting to play for two weeks. Um, I said, you know, in college basketball, there's procedures and, you know, your bone wasn't healed. But that's what type of kid he is. You know, his dad's a high school coach. His grandfather was a longtime coach at my high school, John Carroll. His mom was a Division One player. They are a basketball family through and through. So this kid was dying to play. Got him back, um, which was huge. Shamar had a one-game suspension um, because of the altercation at the end of the game. Unfortunate, um, but we respect the uh, league's decision. Uh, we thought it was the right decision. Um, we're going to learn from that. Uh, we're all going to be better from that. And uh, now we got him back for a really cool trip. You know, last time you're going to go to Chicago to play UIC, you're going to Indianapolis. Uh, one of my favorite trips, Joel. Uh, we actually should take you on the trip. Uh, if, you, if we could get you to come because it's an awesome trip. You're in two major cities. Um, 
a lot of good restaurants, a lot of good food. Um, the kids enjoy doing that. We get two good meals out. Um, but it's a business trip. You know, we got a we got a good opportunity here after these two wins to carry some momentum uh, into into these two games. I think momentum's everything, and I think momentum at the right time can be a can be a dangerous uh, dangerous thing for a sports team. Um, the way Will Dunn's playing, um, with the confidence level and uh, his shooting ability and his athleticism, you know, if him and Mike make shots, we're going to be hard to beat. Um, it's just the bottom line, you know. They, those guys are six eight, six nine, shooting threes today uh, like a guard. I mean, those two kids had nine of our thirteen threes at six eight. Gives you a different dynamic. So we got to build on that, um, you know, and uh, we'll be happy uh, to take the day off tomorrow, get back to work, have a three day prep, and uh, get ready for Thursday, Saturday on the road for two big games. Miles uh, and I had a great talk yesterday. Uh, so we met about 30 minutes, and, um, you know, I've been very open and honest with all our players. This has been, quite honestly, one of the hardest things to ever have to do here in my five years to manage 17 players. So how do you manage 17 players in the sport of basketball that only allows five on the court? It's been difficult. Uh, I'd be lying if, if I tell you it hadn't been. But I really enjoy this group. I like being around them. Um, they love being around um, the university. They all want to be here. They all want to be a part of it. So my message was to Miles, just get into the game and star in your role. Uh, and that was one of, our, one of our key points to all of them. You know, sometimes as a bench guy, you want to get in there and score. You want to get in there and try to affect the game on a scoring standpoint. Um, I don't want them looking over at me, uh, but I want them starring in their role. I thought tonight Miles starred in his role. Uh, this is a young man that went from starting, right, playing 20, 22, 23 minutes to then a backup role to maybe not playing. Uh, we're trying to manage our bench, and we're trying to get the most production out of our bench. I knew this game would be a great matchup for him. Some games it's Chris Shelton. Some games it's Owen Long. Some games it's Ja'Cory. Some games it's Jameer. In the past it was Will, right? I mean, we're playing 10, 11 guys. They've got to understand that um, and embrace that. Let that be our strength. Still having a hard time understanding that, and, and I kind of told the guys that. You know, you get one chance to play college basketball, whatever role you have, accept it, star in it. Eventually, the role becomes a little bit bigger, um, and Harp, uh, we call him Harp, did an awesome job. Really happy for him, and, um, you know, great family, and um, they've been supportive as well. They want him to play a little bit better, and tonight uh, he really delivered.